I have some very exciting news to share. My music studio is getting a major upgrade. Hi, this is Frederick from the techno label Detroit Berlin. I didn't think I was ever going to be able to afford this upgrade to my studio. Now let's hope my remaining kidney doesn't fail me. No. Actually, I got a pretty good deal using some coupon codes and some unexpected support for which I'm very grateful. Also, the feedback and mentorship services I offer are running very well. I get a lot of positive response and when customers return, you know you're giving them a lot of value. If you aren't familiar with these services, I'll put a link in the description below. If you want to lift your productions to the next level, I would say do check them out. Now for everyone who's been to my studio, I know what you're thinking. How could I possibly improve upon this Valhalla of gear and goodies? By the way, at a thousand subscribers I'll do a full studio tour, so if you haven't already, smash that bell button and subscribe. So I've been rocking these GBL 4311 monitor speakers, which are in my opinion very good, especially taken into account they are almost 50 years old. For a few years I had some other monitor speakers on my wish list though. Not to replace these GBLs, because I know their sound inside out, but to provide a second set of ears, which are even more detailed and accurate. The ones I'm talking about are the Adam Audio, S3H monitor speakers. They are near to midfield monitors and are truly amazing. Can't wait until they arrive and I'm able to set them up. In one of my next episodes I'll discuss proper monitor placement, as this could solve some common problems and improve your workflow. Do you have some monitoring problems yourself? Please write them down in the comment section below and I'll try to shine a light on what might be the cause. Thanks for watching.